Welcome, Survivor contestants, to your seventh elimination. Welcome, Hi. Team I Don't Know. So that brings me to my first question of the night. At this point, you've all been here. <clears throat> so now it's time to get down to business. All right. Okay. We are now in our oh, first elimination. Uh, confessional this week, I found very inspiring and empowering and I would like you to talk a little bit more about that. It seems like you had a res realization uh, of the person that you should be listening to the most in this game. Yeah, I just think that I let other people get into my head too much when I realize that I'm very capable of just anything. And the more I doubt myself is the more that other people will succeed. And I, I, I need to start putting myself first. And that's it. That's it. That's amazing. <laughs> yes. Did you hear that, everyone? Everyone at home, everyone yes. in the Zoom right now. Those are words to live by. <clears throat> <clears throat> We're going to move over to Brett. Hi. Hi Brett. Have you Hi. heard yet from last week? I don't know. <laughs> that was pretty <laughs> crushing. <laughs> Yeah, talk to me about that. I know you did 19 burpees, which is definitely more than I could have done in 60 seconds. But uh, you still came up short. So how- Ball sit challenge. And it did not work out in my favor. Um, so we had a little surprise elimination there. Um, <laughs> yes. Shit happens. Well, <clears throat> Congratulations on finishing that challenge nonetheless, Brett. Congratulations for making it here. Thanks. Kate, I wanted to ask you, I know that uh, you were pretty tight with Brady, and I'm curious to know how, uh, uh, how Brady's elimination might have uh, affected some of your relationships with some of the people still in the game. But like, I would feel obliged to kind of stick with him because of how close we are in real life, when even though he, like, he was a strong player, but he might not be the strongest. So I felt bad. Like, I it it just opens up a lot more things now that I can also reach out to other players who I know are also very strong and that are still left here. And like I can, so it's kind of a bit of a relief. But it's but it's not like a personal thing. It's just I had made a promise in the beginning, but now it's not a thing. Got it. Got it. I I see. Okay, that's interesting. 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 So so sort of a pressure relief. Yeah. At the same For time, sure. also being sad. Yeah, because I, I didn't expect that at all. Like I've I figured he had at least like a like a week or two, but I but it's he's chill, I'm chill, it's fine. Awesome, excellent, excellent. Um okay, uh Rich, we're coming over to you. So uh I'm curious to know for you, uh as being a member of the Dynamites, you know, Dynamites had only been to elimination once before the merge. So I'm curious to know if your strategy has changed uh, now that we have merged. What, 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 what does the game look like for you now? Is it different? Do whatever it takes. And this is me doing whatever it takes. Including 23 burpees in 60 seconds. Including 23 burpees. There's a bit of an upperclassman versus freshman or underclassman vibe that started to emerge in the way that the elimin elimination started uh, happening. So I'm curious, Emily, as a member of uh, the team previously known as the Dynamites, if if that was a, is a factor for you, was it? And 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 what do you think that dynamic between the upper and lower class folks? Uh, it, how how is that going to shape out uh, moving forward now that we're in the merge? And I was like, oh my god, they're all going to link up immediately. I knew that like I had to make my own friends and had to like get in and with the freshmen as well and be like, I'm cool guys, like, don't worry. <laughs> like, And so like, I, I feel like I've made alliances with people my own age, upperclassmen, but I'll- Talk to me about how it feels to have been the first contestant to win immunity post merge and how you feel that uh, sets you up moving forward. Well, I mean, first of all, to be on the first season of TTS Survivor and to win the first immunity challenge, I mean, that really makes me feel special regardless. Um, but let me just say, I am terrible, terrible at drinking from a straw, apparently. Like, did you, like, I did, I did that whole game being like, oh, I am so screwed. 
this is so bad. At least I was here to have fun. And um, something, the stars aligned with that slide puzzle because I only had to click like three buttons. And let me just say, since then, I have redone the slide puzzle like 40 times, just refreshing the page and doing it over and over and over again. And I, I've never been able to do it that fast ever again. So <laughs> I have no explanation, but it felt, I mean, so I really didn't expect it. So this has been like pretty awesome. Um, but that doesn't mean that tonight I'm not actually constantly shitting myself. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm just absolutely freaked out. I'm absolutely freaked out. And immunity does not make this day any easier. I can promise you guys all that. Um, did I answer all the questions? <laughs> yes, yes, you did. Very, very well done. Again, you know, this is, this is the, the, the night that I have to slaughter one of my sheep. It's always difficult. Okay, Grace, coming over to you, Grace. Uh, the folks who might be considering uh, uh, sending you home and what you might have to say to them preemptively. So... My choice words were mostly just, I didn't say any bad words. No, you did not, no. I didn't say bad words. I would never slander, slander a dynamite, but I did feel hurt for several reasons, mostly because I, what did I do? Huh? What did I do? I just, lay it out for me. What did I do? Is there something I can improve on? Is there something I can do better? Is or, or was there just, was there just too much to handle? <laughs> was it just, you know, I don't know who thought they, they, they should vote me off, but I don't think they should have done that because it hurt. And I was very confused as to why I was voted off I was attempted to be voted off for no reason. And I will leave it at that. Excellent. Thank you for that, Grace. <laughs> um, I, I mean, I have to say, I think maybe after that, that little pose you struck, I think that maybe you are too. We feel about uh, being on the same team. You were competing against each other for a long time. It was blue versus red, dynamites versus red scare. Any final thoughts on what the dynamic is now that you are all together on this new team, Team Grimace? Go I can it. take that. Um, it's new friends, like, honestly. Like, that's what it is. Like, um, I think, like, I think I have, like, before this, I was like, I'm pretty sure that I've at least texted everyone just to be like, hey, what's up? If I haven't talked to you yet, it's probably because we weren't on the same team, but like, now we are. How are you doing? Let's just show that there is a little bit of goodness left in this theater conservatory. Um, Probably worse. <laughs> yeah. Um, but like, yeah. Just adding on to that, like as a freshman, I, I'm here in Pittsburgh. I'm not in Chicago. Um, and it's been really hard for me to like get to know people and, and meet people in my class. I don't know about the other freshmen, but that's been a constant struggle for me, just trying to get to know people as well as I can. Um, and like the upperclassmen and the people in this group have been so mentoring and so kind and so friendly. And even the people on the other team like are reaching out to me. Um, I just can't say how much that that means to me um, because I don't know, I, I feel like I'm missing out on a lot. I have serious FOMO um, and you guys all have my back and, and you guys have done so much for me through this, even though we're competing. So thank you. I always love these these good happy vibes that we get to bask in a few minutes before right before we kick before you crush the, the axe drops. Um, so thank you for bringing that vibe into the room, Zoe and Robert. <laughs> All right, well, you know, let's just get to it. This is the part that no one wants to do, but it is the part that we must do. That is our mission here tonight. It is time to set one of your fellow contestants adrift. As I call your name, I would like for you to private message me the name of the contestant you feel deserves to be eliminated tonight. First up, we have Rich. Next up, Jordan, Kate, Grace, Brett, Camille, 
Matthew, Zoe, Robert, have an immunity item to, that they would like to use to either save themselves or a fellow contestant, please private one vote for Rich. A vote for Kate. A second vote for Kate. A vote for Brett. Another vote for Kate. Another vote for Rich. And a final vote for Kate. This brings our vote totals to two votes for Brett three votes for Rich, and five votes for Kate. Kate, I am so sorry to tell you, you know what that means. You have been eliminated from Survivor TTS 2020. Is there anything that you would like to say to your fellow contestants or to the audience before you head out? Shocked, but at least I got my Wednesday nights back and Monday nights, have fun y'all. <laughs> What a way to go out. I love that. Good vibes. Good vibes always. I remember, Kate, one of the first episode you first episodes I asked you how you were doing, and you were like, oh, you know, I'm just vibing. <laughs> That's what I'm doing. I'm just vibing here. It do, it do fully be just a vibe. So I appreciate that attitude that you brought into the game. Kate was an excellent competitor. We'll miss her good vibes in this room. I do have some unfortunate news for you, which is that I will be asking you in a moment to participate in a second vote to eliminate a second contestant on tonight's episode. I'm going to give you just- Why? Why? <laughs> what is wrong with you, producers? Brief moment to process. Let's do it. I'm ready. Come on, bring it on. Let's do it right now. Eliminate another one. I don't give a fuck. I'm over it. Let's go. Come on. Again, there are only so many weeks left in the quarter, and there are, frankly, too many. No one's going to vote for you, OK? Everyone likes you. <laughs> Matthew, you still have immunity for this second vote. I'm just no double more discussion, no more time to set a drift for our second vote of the night. First up, we have Robert. Next up, Jordan. Then we have Emily, Rich, Matthew, Grace, Brett, Zoe, and Camille. Again, give me a few moments while I tally the vote. So, uh, hi guys. Let's talk about that last vote. Hello, question mark? Hello? Hi, no one's saying anything? I am shocked to say the least. Okay, cool. 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 I just feel like at this point, we all have a very clear idea of who's playing the game. And I feel like we're just all aware of that at this point. It's not to say I'm not, but it be what it be. I definitely think that there are, are some people in this game who are more trustworthy and supportive than others, for sure. And I think that the, the last vote may have solved that, so. Yeah, a lot of true colors definitely came out in that last vote. Good to know, good to know. Excited to see how the second one turns out. Give it to me, Antonio, come on. All right, everyone, the votes are in. And before I read them, I would like to provide one more opportunity for anyone who has an immunity item to play it on themselves or another contestant. Your opportunity is now. You can private message me. All right, y'all. Second round of votes. We have a vote 
for Brett. Hefty. We have a second vote for Rich. A vote for Robert. A vote for Rich. A vote for Brett. A vote for Rich. Another vote for Rich. And a final vote for Rich. That brings our vote totals to one vote for Robert, two for Brett, and six votes for Rich. Rich, I am so sorry to tell you what you already know, which is that you have been eliminated from Survivor TTS tonight. Is there anything that you would like to say to your contestants or our audience before you leave? I'm shocked, first of all. I'm, I'm very shocked, but I'm happy that I was able to make it this far to top nine. And I'm in a room full of some strong competitors. And I know I'm not bitter. I'm irritated. I'm also bitter. Um, Y'all will be hearing about this in the confessionals. Um, <laughs> no, but I love you guys. And I love this, 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 whatever this mess is that we've created. We've been able to create theater in times where I thought this was impossible. So from the bottom of my heart, I, I hope, I hope you guys take a tape. It was also pretty stellar, uh, very funny. Who knows, maybe we'll have an opportunity um, on a later episode to revisit some of those. But Rich, thank you, you so much. Episode. And you are free to leave Zoom. Bye guys. Holy shit. Oh my God. Oh, so so small. This is so, ah. Uh. This keeps right. my heart rate going <laughs> every week <laughs> without fail. It. I'm having every single COVID symptom at the same time. <laughs> this is horrible. <laughs> Survivor TTS may cause symptoms of COVID-19. Well, that was difficult. Um, I, You all know at this point, I don't enjoy throwing these twists at you, but it is my job. Um, we are now a very intimate eight. Eight contestants remain out of 18 Whoa. on the current season of Survivor TTS. <laughs> now those two contestants that just left will be members of our jury moving forward. Yes! Party! Happy wow. Drama. <laughs> and the jury will be yeah, present at <laughs> elimination episodes starting next week. All right, y'all. That was difficult. It was dirty business, but we had to do it. I'm proud of everyone. Please take care of yourselves. Rest. Take naps. Drink lots of water. Eat food. If you are having a rough time, us to the end of our seventh elimination of, from Survivor TTS. Until next time. Welcome to the eighth Immunity Challenge, Team Grimace. Why are you putting us through this? This is personal. Can you use that in a sentence, please, Antonio? Fuck you, Antonio. We failed the producers, and we're sorry. <laughs>